Another option you can do to modify your layers are called layer effects. Now here they are shown. Um, try something down here in your layers palette. So I am going to click on the me and Malloy layer and click again down here on this EFF for effects. One of the cool ones that would look really good, I think, on this one, I've taken off the previous uh, blend mode, is the uh, outer glow. So I'm going to choose that one. Now I get some options, and I want to make sure that I can see what's happening, and it looks like I can. I'm going to change this blend mode to normal, just so it's more visible for you. You can always keep it at screen. That's probably a good way to do it. Now here, these are the options you want to play with. Spread is how far out it goes, and size is the same. Come on, there it goes. You can change the color. This one's kind of like a funky yellow. I'm going to try to choose something closer to like the pinks in the sky. Oh, I like that. Okay. That one works too. Um, spread is how far out it goes. Size is how big, which seems very similar. Not quite. And then some of these other ones are noise is if it looks smooth or if it looks like a little bit jagged on the edges, more like spray paint, which I think I like that effect. And let's see if I put this back to screen. How does that look? Oh, okay. So this is a layer style and you have other ones too. The one I just showed you is outer glow. You can apply multiple layer styles, although at some point it becomes a little bit ridiculous. Um, drop shadows tend to look really good on text. And you can see here it's on the side. When I turn it on and off, you can see it show up. Overlays. Inner glow puts the glow on the inside of the shape or the image. Bevel and emboss changes how the edges look. Kind of see it there. It did a small bevel. And this is one, again, where changing the options is where you're going to get A more visible change. Come on, you can do it. I believe in you, Photo P. There it goes. Just leave it there for now. So those are some more options you have are layer styles or layer effects, and they hang out at the bottom of your layers palette.